that word. Tell's safe. There's lots of security. No, no. That was just a fight. But he wanted. You're the sexiest nerd I've ever met. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, guys. Welcome back to the channel once again. Today, I'm super, super, mega excited to be sharing this video with you guys because I've been waiting for uh, quite a while to do this review on this couple because I just recently got, you know, on their storyline, even though the storyline have been going on since season two. I just had to go ahead and speak about the relationship that actually is developing and does have a happy ending between Yolanda and Arthur on the show called glow but before we get into further details please don't forget to like comment share subscribe let me know your thoughts down below in the comments because like i always say your opinion does matter so let's get right into further details so basically the show follows and take a look at the personal and professional lives of a group of women who performed for wrestling organization in Los Angeles during the 1980s. So in season three, it's basically set at Los, in this case, at Las Vegas, where they actually go on tour every night to have, they have to do the same performance in just a very big group of women with different lives, different experience, different, you know, partners, and just everybody kind of has their own storyline going on. But when it's time to perform their wrestling, they actually come together as a group so my main focus is to actually speak about Yolanda and Arthur's relationship so basically during season two you know that the relationship took things to the next level and they have decided to be together and see you know how things will go such a beautiful couple they have very different views on certain topics but some way somehow they came together and have decided to be in a relationship now moving forward to season three you can see at the beginning of the season they are very lovey-dovey things between them are going well but as the episodes progresses you can actually see that Arthur is going through a moment you know a moment of of self-discovery and of course Yolanda is also like not understanding what is going on with Arthur so let me break it down for you guys real quick so basically at the beginning you can actually see that Arfi when she and Yolanda they get intimate she doesn't like that Yolanda actually touches her so Yolanda kind of you know was confused the fact that you know her partner doesn't want her to also you know do things to her and of course Yolanda felt that type of way because Arthur never told her anything about it so they kind of got into an argument and an altercation because you know Ar Arthur was also not understanding why Yolanda was acting the way she did because you know they actually never had a conversation regarding it so as things progresses you can actually see in the salon they got into this argument and they just didn't understand why each other were mad at one another like what is going on and yes later on of course you know Yolanda and Arthur they spoke about it and basically Yolanda told Arthur hey you know you are my partner you're my girlfriend I just really also want to you know please you the same way you please me and I feel like you don't allow me and then Arthur was like the reason why I don't is because I'm not very you know secure in my body I don't feel very confident and of course Yolanda just made her feel very confident and from that moment on they could overcome this you know thing that was holding them back intimacy wise then later on moving forward you know there's a couple of episodes where they don't really appear until further on where you can actually see that in this case Arthur is starting to have you know her own question regarding her her identity she doesn't know if she is if she is actually a lesbian she's she's like hey Yolanda I love you I want to be with you I have no doubts regarding my feelings towards you but I'm not 100% sure if I'm actually gay and of course Yolanda was caught by surprise because all of this time Yolanda thought that she was they are in a relationship she never you know, thought that RC wasn't. So Yolanda was like, you know, I'm not going to wait until you figure it out. This is what we're going to do. We're going to part ways. You do you, I do me. Because the last thing I'm going to do is basically be in a bubble with a woman that is confused or that might be straight in this case and of course Arthur was caught by surprise but she also understood Yolanda's position because at the end of the day she doesn't want to uh, hold Yolanda back also so they actually end up breaking up for a while but some way somehow 
at the end of the day they will still will have to see each other every single day because they work together but they was just keeping things professional between them you know they were really really just trying to keep things professional until a very unfortunate event actually happened when they went to a party and you know there was people outside who were being very mean towards you know the community and that moment you know Arthur was very touched by that moment because you see how the world is very, very against the community because this show, show is actually set in the 1980s and we all know that back then things were way different than what it is currently. So after that moment, Arthur was very touched by it. You know, Yolanda was also very emotional by it because they actually set, you know, a, a club on fire. So it was just a very emotional moment. And not even also that after that moment, you know, during Christmas, you can actually see that uh, in this case, Arthur, she just went through a very emotional stage when she realized that maybe she is gay and maybe it's time for her to accept that she is and stop running from it, you know. So, and the thing that I liked about it is that Yolanda never pressured her to figure it out. Yolanda was like, hey, you go do you, figure you out, you know, I'm hurt because I don't want to imagine that I've been all of this time with you and you're not who I think you are. But at the end of the day, do you, I'm going to do me. And if we get back together, we do, despite the love that we feel for one another. So during Christmas, you know, Arthur, during a moment, she just have decided, you know, after everything, she went on emotionally and with Yolanda and the club situation, everything. She just went in front of her public, in front of her crew and just told everybody, hey, I'm gay. And she finally could admit it to the public. Not that she was hiding, you know, because everybody already knew she was. But she was like, no, I just want to say just to reinforce it, you know. And I feel like she also needed to say it more for her, you know, for herself instead of the public. So after that, everybody embraced her because everybody already knew. They gave her this nice, you know, um, bright thing for her head and since that she always been wearing it. I don't, I'm not 100% sure if she and Yolanda got back together because the ending scene kind of gave me like, okay, we cool vibes, but I'm not 100% sure if they actually got back together with one another because they actually was at the airport, you know, because there was, was only a two, two months event, you know, of the wrestling organization. So after that, everybody went back home. But the ending scene kind of gave me like they are back on good terms, but they are not back together or maybe they are. I don't know. Hopefully we will see that in season four. But, you know, if you guys haven't watched the show, I will highly, highly, highly recommend it. It's very good. It's very good. And each episode is actually like 30 minutes long, which is pretty straight to the point. And there are three seasons available and you can watch it on Netflix. One thing I have to say, I really like the patience that Yolanda had. You know, I really like the fact that Yolanda knows she wants to be with Arthur. But she also knew that Arthur was at the moment of confusion, you know, even though it was hurting her to let Arthur go. But she also knew that she had to do it, you know, because at the end of the day, Yolanda, she's also her own person. And the fact that she also has to hide her orientation because of, you know, her job, her work and, you know, the environment she works in also is like very heavy on her. She also gets exhausted. And now to have a partner that, you know, also is confused about her situation is like, well, I'm already dealing with this at work, which we all know what our circumstances is. And now when it's time to lay down, you know, my partner also has her doubts on who she is regarding, you know, her, her identity. So it was just a lot for the ladies to deal with. But I'm really happy that they could figure it out. And Arthur finally accepted who she is. And she's very happy and proud. And Yolanda was very happy when she saw that, you know, Arthur finally, you know, could stand on, you know, stand on her truth. So yes, guys, that's basically it. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. I also activated the super stickers to the channel just in case any of you would like to make a small donation. Until the next video and good night.